Hey guys, it's Teen with a Top Hat here. See this? Golden Top Hat. It's feeling good today. Alright, so, um, you guys want to know, let's get to me. Alright, you, you guys want to know, how do I make a clickable, um, a clickable teleporter? Well, you know what? That's actually pretty easy. <laughs> Why did I do that? I don't know. But, um, anyways, you don't have to do all this stuff, like how there's a wall here and there's a little button here. I just did that to decorate it and make it look better. It isn't even that good. I didn't detail it very much because this is just a tutorial video. So, yeah. Anyways, so you want to place in your part. Feel free to size it and color it as much as you want. None of that matters. It's, it will still work just the same. So then once you've got your part and it's working perfectly fine, Either right click the part, go to insert object, and insert a click detector, and do that again in, with a script, or just push this button, put in a click detector, and put in a script. And yeah, I'm just gonna do what I just did right there, the plus button, because it's way easier. Alright, so the script, I'm gonna leave the link. Uh, sorry, not the link. I'm gonna leave the script in the script. I'm gonna leave the script in the description. Eh, come on, that one was kind of good. Come on, guys. Come on. Oh, man, you guys have no sense of humor. All right. Um. Anyways, uh, I'm gonna cut out this bit because putting in the script takes some time. So I'll be at, I'll be back in a sec. Alright guys, I'm back. I just got the script put in here. And, uh, yeah, this is the section. Once you've got the script put into the part, then, um, this thing is right here will dictate where it teleports to. You're probably wondering, boy, how do I know where the, what the coordinates are? And I'll tell you that in just a second. But before I do, let's test this first just to make sure that it works. Yes, I did not anchor it. I'm sorry. Yeah, it works. It works. Alright, so, what you're going to want to do is, uh, you're going to want to grab this little script here. See this? Don't grab the script. And, uh, you're going to, you're going to want to place another part. Model, part. Got yourself a part right here. Just Place it pretty much anywhere. It should work, uh, no matter where you are. Get out your properties, and um, sorry, and place it like anywhere. I was moving the face cam so I could uh, mess around with the properties. Move it the to the place that you would like it to teleport to. Uh, I I don't really care where you have it. It's only temporary. No guys are not gonna teleport on it unless you want to. I I don't I don't care. But, um, anyways, if you want to teleport onto it, you see, you see this the position? Yeah, you do? Yeah, I know. Too good. Ah, uh, sorry. Anyways, so you're going to want to, you're going to want to take this thing, the position. It's basically the position is the, not the location. My bad. My bad. It is. I'm stupid. That's what I am. Alright. So you're going to want to copy this. And um, then you're going to want to go back into the Explorer. Go to the script again. And then replace these things with these. Or something like the area you, you want to teleport to. Test. And then it should work now. So basically, you see this button, you click it, and you're teleported. And um, just to make sure that it works, and uh, sorry, just to make sure that it works with anchored stuff, because obviously you don't want your buttons and stuff to, you know, just fall off. Let's anchor it and let's see if it works. All right. To anchor it, by the way, you got to go into properties, click on this thing. Bam. Alright, now let's test it. Moment of truth. 
All right, so we're just gonna be this this random player, okay? Ooh, is that a button? Oh, <gasps> I wonder what it does. <laughs> well, guys, well, that's all for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed the Roblox Studio tutorial. Anyways, peace out.